This video is sponsored by Skillshare. Learn the desired skills as per your hobby and interest with the help of Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community for creative and curious people where you can find so many inspiring classes ranging from animation, writing, films, graphic design, illustration, photography to web development. I have completed a class on hand lettering in Procreate Fundamentals to Finishing Touches by Gia Graham. This class really helped me a lot as the content is very engaging. Here is a short preview of the course. If you're brand new to digital hand lettering and you're not quite sure where to begin, then this is the class for you. Hi, my name is Gia Graham and I'm a lettering artist and illustrator based in Atlanta, originally from Barbados. I have 20 years experience in graphic design, but I started digital hand lettering in 2018 and it has completely changed my career and the way I work. Experience real-time inspiration as you connect with the popular teachers while watching and working along with other members. The first thousand of my subscribers to click the link in the description will get a one month free trial of Skillshare so you can start exploring your creativity today. Hey guys, Creative Venus here and welcome to another beautiful tutorial. In today's video, we will learn how to create a beautiful morph transition with the help of 3D elements and we will use some real 3D elements. So let's begin with the tutorial and if you haven't subscribed to our channel please do that this will really help us and support us. Now to begin with we need this kind of background a space related background because we want to showcase uh, uh, the 3D art and an astronaut and for that you need to go to the insert section then click on 3D models and click on 3D stock 3D models and it will open a library of 3D elements for you. Now you need to click on, uh, sorry, you need to type Earth, press enter, and here you will find lots of space related things here. And we will pick this Earth, this looks realistic. Now type astronaut, we also need one astronaut. And here you will find lots of beautiful 3D elements in the result. But let's pick this astronaut. And let's pick this as well. And let's pick the Earth as well. Now click on insert and it will take some time. Guys, here we have downloaded all these three 3d elements and here when you select any of the 3d elements you'll see this button you can rotate it in any direction with the help of this button that's the beauty of 3d this is a real 3d element and similarly you can do the same with the astronaut and then with the earth as well and here you can see some elements has some additional scenes with them and for example with the astronaut here you will see it has got these four scenes now let's click on the second scene and it will you know uh, move left to right in the third scene it will wave at you in the fourth scene it will run so let's click on the first scene so now you can design the overall slide so let's do it Let's place the earth here, decrease the size of this astronaut and move it like this and let's rotate this spaceship like this. Now just duplicate the slide and move the earth here. and send this spaceship away and you can create an illusion by reducing its size and this illusion really works if you reduce its size it will look like that it is very far and increase the size of this astronaut 
and rotate it to the left. Now again duplicate the slide and we will increase the size of the earth now like this and place it here and decrease the size of this astronaut slightly move it like this now bring it bring the spaceship here like this again duplicate now reduce the size of the earth like this now earth is very far away and rotate the spaceship like this increase the size and also move the astronaut so this is just for just for fun and and this is not how things work in the space and astronaut cannot move like this in the space this is just for fun so now we have created these four slides now comes the animation part click on the earth and click on turnable and you need to open the animation pane here right click on the effects option and go to timing and repeat until the end of the slide and now the earth will keep on rotating on its axis and while this animation is selected here you need to click on start with previous now it will automatically start when you will click on the slideshow mode similarly here you need to click on this earth and again apply this animation so now we have applied all the animations on these four slides now click all these four slides select and go to transitions and click on morph so once you will apply the morph transition then you can see the magic here click on slideshow mode and you can see now the earth has started spinning and this astronaut is also moving now jump to the next slide and you can see how the things move and animate now jump to the third slide and now comes the fourth slide so this is how you can play with the 3d elements in the powerpoint and you can also place the text on the left right top or bottom of the screen on each of the slides and you can showcase the pointers to explain the context here so we'll see you guys in our next video till then enjoy and do not forget to subscribe to our channel